Despite the threat of harassment and arrest, tens of thousands of opposition activists, supporters and leaders showed up at this rally. The president of the opposition BNP party women's wing is voicing defiance. We want respite from this illegal government's draconian rule and repression. Everyone should have the same rights, political freedom and the right to vote. Bangladesh's main opposition party says it will boycott a general election in January. That's in protest against a months-long crackdown that has seen thousands of party activists, supporters and leaders harassed, threatened and arrested. We are not afraid of threats and arrests. We will stay in the street, whatever the intimidation and the harassment may be. We will all unite and work together for our rights. The opposition's key demand is that the election be held under a caretaker administration. But the government has rejected that and blames the opposition for violence and public disorder. They are keeping the general population hostage by throwing petrol bombs and burning vehicles. Bangladesh could have made more progress if there was no culture of political violence. The government is also increasingly coming under pressure from the United Nations, the United States and the European Union to ensure a free and fair election. What election? Is this some kind of game? There's no political opposition party taking part in the upcoming elections in Bangladesh. Bangladesh is barely three weeks away from the general election due on January 7. But the current political turmoil and a poll boycott by the main opposition party are leading many people to question its credibility. Sanvit Chaudhary, Al Jazeera, Dhaka. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.